Not sure why, but we got one. We got uh, the percentage of homes year round. That is how many houses on the street versus how many people live there year round is the highest on paying cost of any, any street in the park. Uh, I think when I counted the other day, I think we had 10 or 11 year round residences on paid cup. That's a handy thing. Uh, we like to think it's a pretty safe place. And uh, give you some other statistics. Uh, uh, according to my good friend and neighbor, Kent Wilcox, uh, we have the highest concentration of firearms. <laughs> uh, he told me the other day that the Texas National Guard borrowed ammunition from him. <laughs> and the Blake Twins ran out of something the other day and called and said, Kent, can you help us out? And he did. So we don't worry too much about things going on there towards the back gate. One of the big things we want to thank you guys for, the ones of you don't live on Pan Cup, and that is to use our street. We appreciate that a lot, you know, because uh, you could use another street. And, and one of the other things, uh, you know, I live down there by the back, back fence, and people go out the gate there right in front of my house. And I can't tell you how pleased I am this year. I am so impressed. This is the first year I haven't had to count the number of fingers of people waving as they went by. <laughs> we're, getting, we're getting an average of four and a half fingers now, which is a lot better than we usually do. <laughs> Some of you may, oh, there's uh, and we like to do a little commercial for anybody's house on the street that's for sale. And we'd like to tell you that there is one house for sale. Uh, uh, Mr. and Mrs. North have a house for sale. Everything else is sold the last couple of weeks. Uh, uh, Larry McMahon bought a house on the street. That makes him uh, a half cupian, I guess. So you can draw your own conclusions what that means. But he just bought a place. And we have some new folks here at the Pauls who uh, bought Betty King's house. And Betty King is here today, a great friend of ours. We're so glad to see her. Betty didn't retire, by the way. She's up here living at uh, Brookridge, and uh, uh, she's a, a commissioned representative. So anybody that would like to know anything about Brookridge, see Betty. Every time somebody signs up, she gets a free month. <laughs> Some of you folks may not know, but Painted Cup is the only street in the park that has its own national anthem. It's, well, it's not really a national anthem, because we're not trying to claim that we're a nation. But we do have our own street song. And normally we would ask everybody to stand, but we're not going to do that. Because the last time we asked, nobody did. So we're not going to. But while we do that, everybody who now lives on Painted Cup, stand up for a second. Let's see who you are. Come on. Come on, no, we want everybody to stand up now. Everybody that used to live on Painted Cup, stand up. Now everybody that would like to live on Painted Cup, stand up. <laughs> That's the only way we get everybody to stand up in this national anthem. <laughs> anyway, since you really don't believe that we got one, Marky and I are going to sing it to you. We do this every year before we start this, and most people still stay anyways. Oh, and by the way, she's playing the ukulele, and if you don't know what this is, this is what happens when you leave your banjo and your ukulele unattended overnight. <laughs> it's a cross between a banjo and a ukulele called a banjo lady. So, it sounds like a ukulele. And it sounds like something, she said. She wouldn't say what. <coughs> All right, so you about ready to do this? I'm ready. All right, let's go here. Feel 
feel like you belong because on the street, your paradise street, you're bound to like the people you meet. But our street is a paradise street because the lives we make. Come on, boy. The folks with me delighted if you make your way along. Come on. Like you belong because our street is paradise street. You're bound to like the people you be. But our street is the paradise street. The paradise we make it. The paradise we make Now we're going to get the band up here, we're going to do something serious. So uh, you, hey, you guys noticed that song was a little bit low for me, but I have to sing it in this key. A little bit low for me? I thought it was a little bit low for me. Then it was a little bit low. You know, Jim Jenny said he wanted to get up here and sing that one. This we should have let him. Okay, I think so. <laughs> we got some folks here today helping us out. Uh, we're going to introduce everybody before we get started. This is Dale Wayman, if you never met him. He, he lives here in the park, and uh, Dale got up out of the sick bed to do this today. We appreciate him doing that a lot. You might give him a round of applause for showing up. <laughs> and we've got our own uh, far south, also known as the Rio Trio here today. Judy, Jay, and Margie, they're going to be doing some stuff for you. <laughs> and then coming up now in that green striped shirt, there's a fellow... It, uh, from, uh, let's see, Woodward, Iowa, if I remember. And uh, one of the only guys from Iowa that was willing to miss part of the game to come today, Mr. Dan Steele, and uh, he, he's going to play guitar with us. And he also is a tremendous steel player, but we're going to use him on guitar today. And then over here on the other side, some really nice people from way, 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 way western uh, Nebraska. So close that uh, their bathroom or living room one is in Colorado. I don't remember which it is. Oh, but that's where the jack Rabbits, they carry a lunch out there in our part of the country. <laughs> Way over in western Nebraska. The wind jammers. So we're looking forward to having everybody here today. Aren't they called jackalopes out in your area? Jackalopes? Jackalopes is only when you send the girls out to look for them and you set the truck and laugh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do um, Y'all Come. You're all going to help me on this, I hope. All right, everybody's going to sing in on this, right? Everybody. We're going to get everybody involved, okay? Whenever you're ready, let's just hit it up. <laughs> Thank you. 
Us gals have had a lot of fun working together on our music. We get together every Sunday afternoon, and <clears throat> Dick and Donna get serenaded. I don't. <laughs> they're right next to us. Okay. Amarillo by morning, 
all from San Antonio. Everything that I got and is just what I got on. Oh, that sun is high in the Texas sky. I'll be barking at the county fair. Amarillo by morning. Amarillo, I'll be there. Broker saddle in Houston. Lay in Santa Fe Lost your wife and girlfriend Somewhere along the way But I'll be pulling for me When they pull that game Oh, I hope the judge ain't blind Amarillo by morning Before he went back in the fifth wheel, and he's thinking about getting out of the fifth wheel, and we need to do all we can do to encourage him to become a far southian again, folks. If you say something about that, we can include taking up a collection. <laughs> hey, to Wayne Jammer, this is fun. I've, I've had the opportunity to work with these two folks uh, several times in the past, and they're always a lot of fun to work with. They're nice people. And uh, you just, just couldn't ask for, for better folks and better entertainment. I'm glad they agreed to come up and help us out with this show today. He can say that. I mean, he has to put up with five months out of the year or so. He That's can right. Say that. Put your hands together and welcome to Wayne Jammers to Park Tower. Where do I go to live when I get home? Thank you. 
weekend. It's always fun. Let's get Mr. Dale Wayman to take center stage and see what he's going to play for. You know, if you want to know anything about anything, you ask Mike. <laughs> I just had to explain that. No, no, about five or six years ago, I was looking for a car. And he told me how to buy a car in Texas. So I'm not going to get into this, but if you need to buy a car in Texas, used or new, ask Mike. Maybe I'll ask you later, right? <laughs> hey, Dave, you ought to explain what this is. Uh, you ought to explain what this is. Oh, explain that? Yeah. I'm, I, you know what? <clears throat> I've never seen one of those, <laughs> but it, it is a, it, it's a set of drums and a snare. On the outside perimeter is a snare, and as you come in closer, you have a, a drum and a bass drum right in the middle. And I guess I guess you have to be a judge in order to play one. <laughs> Or a Puerto Rican. I just, I, that's where it came from. I'm a very poor speaker, but I just love getting at that guy. <laughs> Key of D, another day, another dollar. <laughs> Another day, another dollar. Daylight comes, I'm on my way. Another day, another dollar. Just a work in my whole life away. A family, my thanks to you. I love them for and for this day. That's the reason I keep on living, just working my whole life away. The boss man said, he paid me for That's exactly how I want to pay. Another day, another dollar, just working my whole life away. upside down we sure are grateful she finally figured which hand was up. <coughs> Tell, it's the truth, isn't it? She said she didn't hear me, but I got the dirty look. <laughs> the way it happens in my house all the time. Blue roses, love 
looking for the moon in someone's eyes. Blue roses will lead to believe in someone's love.
skip Miss Judy O'Hara up here now. Stay back on my stool. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, okay. Well, you all get in any place you want to here, but uh, uh, we're going to be watching to see who's not singing. So we want to see everybody, you know, make a lot of noise. With you, yeah, we're doing this. We're doing it in C, by the way, in case you didn't know. Yeah, we're going to try this in C. I'm not really sure. We couldn't find the key I could sing it in, so we're going to do it in C. When I was a little bitty boy, my grandmother brought me a beautiful toy. Silver bells hanging on a string. She told me it was my ding a ling My ding a my ding a around you. Yes, 
stuff that is good on everybody. And this song, uh, you've got a part to do. And if you do it well, you may be rewarded, but if you do it badly, something terrible could happen. <laughs> but, uh, we're going to do a little song you may have heard of in the past, and you're going to sing the chorus called My Ding Ling. <laughs> now, my ding a ling, honey, my ding a ling. <laughs> you get to sing here. Does everybody know how that goes? Anybody got a call? My ding a ling, my ding a ling, I'll be playing with my ding a ling. You know, you figured it out because we're going to sing it more than one. And uh, this is not, uh, uh, this is compulsory participation. If we see anybody not, uh, not playing, we have some evil thing that's going to happen. <laughs> so, the trio is going to help you sing your part. And uh, Dale's going to help us sing my part, and I guess y'all can just jump in if you want to. I'm going to stay back on my stool. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, okay. Well, y'all get in any place you want to here, but uh, uh, we're going to be watching to see who's not singing. So we want to see everybody, you know, make a lot of noise. We're, yeah, we're doing this. We're doing it in C, by the way, in case you didn't know. Yeah, we're going to try this and see. I'm not really sure. We couldn't find the key I could sing it in, so we're going to do it and see. When I was a little bitty boy, my grandmother brought me a beautiful toy. Silver bells hanging on a string. She told me it was my ding a ling My ding a ling my ding a ling What do you play with? Can you believe we got somebody who is not singing? I can't believe we got somebody that's not singing. Young lady, I caught you not singing. You come right up here on this stage right now. Come on. Come up on this stage right now. Come on, come up here. This is teach you. Now, this lady just bought a house in this park not two weeks ago and she's already caught on stage. Step, step right there and tell everybody who you are and where you live. I'm Bar Paul and we live in at 287 Painted Cup. Which, by the way, is uh, after this show will now be available for purchase. <laughs> okay, now we have a problem here because we saw you not sing. That's not true. And now we're going to have to do something about it. Well, I was looking over there and it sure didn't look so. We're going to sing something to you personally, okay? And look right at look at my eyes, honey. 
Okay, I'm gonna sing this just to you, okay? Now this song, it ain't so bad. The cutest little song we ever had. But you, the person who would not sing, you must be playing with your name. <laughs> She must be playing with her own ding ling Her ding ling She must be playing with her own ding ling Okay, I'm going to stop one more time. Now, just because you wouldn't sing with us, we decided that you didn't have a ding ling Well, honey, you now have your own ding ling You can hear it now. I think we got another person in the act, guys. Okay, let's take this out here. Everybody ready? My ding a -ling, my ding a -ling, won't you play with my ding a -ling, my ding a -ling, my ding a -ling, I want you to play with my ding a -ling. I want you to play with my ding a -ling. Yeah, after we get something like that, Margie's going to kind of pick up the pieces. <laughs> Together again? Not deep. Together again.
If you ever in Woodward, I would look Dan up. He's got uh, two extra RV pads behind the house. He's always glad to have company. At least he just found out that he is. <laughs> Work for me? Mm -hmm. Still in single. Couldn't sleep last night, just walked the floor. Don't know how I'll stand this anymore. Since I lost you, received your invitation to the blue. I don't know why you caused me such pain. I just know I'll never go through this much again. Lonely me, I don't know what to do. An invitation to the blue. I'll play it here.